billion trillion million billion trillions of orbiting snowballs orbiting snowballs orbiting snowballs a flat fact a flat fact the realm do you know what the realm is a story we agree to tell each other over and over till we forget that it's a lie Greetings, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back. I have a little problem. I was in the middle of making a video about this symbol. This symbol is Ingaz, or Ing. It is an old symbol. It means family, fertility. This is the basic translation. This symbol, or the meaning of this symbol, can be found in many place names. For example, Birmingham. When we look at the word, we have Berm, Ing and ham. When we dissect Birmingham, we see ham, family, and berm. Berm is an olden term for describing land. They also use the word acre, hundred, and ton, like ham ton, the ton of ham, or the land of the family ham again. There are numerous olden Anglo Saxon words for describing plots of land, which I'm not going to go into for this video. When you see the symbol, it looks like DNA, and I thought it was very interesting. And interesting that the symbol means fertility and family. It looks like DNA, doesn't it? So, I went to find a real photograph of DNA, and I ran into a problem. The same problem I ran into when trying to find real photographs of the atom, or real photographs of the Earth from outer space. I've worked in 3D programming since the mid-1990s, as well as other programming genres. Back in the day, I had to write the 3D in code and it would take almost a day to render a very small file. If you needed to make a web page, you had to do it in pure code as there was no software to automatically create a web page like nowadays. No what you see is what you get editors. Point being, I know very well what 3D CGI graphics looks like. So I loaded up Google Images to find a real picture of DNA to use for my video. And what do I find? 3D CGI. Diagrams explaining DNA. Graphics. Graphics. More graphics. 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 This is a graphical image of DNA stain. I mean, really? Graphics. Graphics. Oop, here we go. This is a DNA stain. This is an autoradiogram of DNA. Radio. Radio waves. Not an image of the DNA helix. This is also very similar to the radio waves of the periodic table. Ooh. Google says, microscope images. Let's have a look. Hmm. Sorry, that's graphics. This image is not real either. Ha, ah, look. It even tells you. It says, CGI visualization of the many DNA helix. An electronic microscope simulation with focus effect. Why would you need an electronic microscope simulation? This is a DNA image with an electronic microscope. Can you see the DNA helix? I can't either. Here is someone asking which microscope can see DNA. The answer given is the TEM, the Transmission Electron Microscope, which will show you an image like this. So how did Watson and Crick find the DNA helix back in the 1950s? Oh, look at this. Maths, as in mathematics, shows how DNA twists and turns and unzips. I don't want mathematics. I want a real image, thank you. 
I've been told my entire life that this is what DNA looks like. Can anyone please show me evidence of the existence of the DNA helix that someone has actually photographed? Not a theoretical explanation, not 3D CGI or graphics, not radio wave data and not photo 51 which also doesn't show the double helix. Is there any?